my uh, message to our team after the game, um, I, I thought our guys did compete very hard for both halves. I'm uh, really pleased with forcing 17 turnovers. Um, you know, our full court pressure did make a difference. It did affect them at certain times. Um, I didn't think our transition defense was very good. But the feeling that our guys have in the locker room right now, after shooting 26%, being held to 49 points, um, is a feeling that's not good. It's not something that we're accustomed to or many teams in the country are accustomed to. Um, however, that is what Kentucky has done to every opponent that they've played so far. And you know, we knew coming into this game as a coaching staff that they were, sh they were holding opponents to 28% from the field. And that's absolutely amazing. Um, our team, I told them, they were just guarded by the best defensive team in the modern era of college basketball. And I'm not exaggerating a little bit when I say that. Um, I, I like the way our guys stuck with it. I thought a couple of our new guys really did compete well. Uh, Coach, in a game like this, uh, is this just sort of an aberration that you uh, that doesn't apply to the rest of the season? No. Um, you know, I really thought we would attack them better, so I knew how good they were defensively, but I thought we could take advantage of some of their taller players off of the dribble more, and we weren't able to beat them cleanly enough off the dribble. So we did go by some guys, but not enough to create enough help. Um, so we need to be a better shooting team, but a lot of what happened tonight was because of Kentucky's defense. Jeff, when, when Denzel was in here, of course he had a pretty good shooting game, but he said, First, he didn't think the Kentucky defenders were that good. <laughs> uh, we do need to do more media training. <laughs> Denzel's the young man who's only been in our program for a few months. And uh, I, I certainly would like to give the Kentucky defenders credit because even their taller players, guys that in most programs would be defending five men, they're out there on the perimeter guarding three men and doing a pretty good job. So I, I was impressed. I was not trying to be a wise guy, but I think three times Kentucky called time to try to regroup. Do you take some satisfaction from that? Not necessarily from Kentucky calling a timeout, you know, because that was his choice, but more so from forcing 17 turnovers. You know, we got eight steals, we forced 17 turnovers. And our second half defense was actually good. You know, our half court defense, our press defense. Now, transition wise, we're going to be a much better team, and that's on me. But you know, the other the other great stat, they only got 10 offensive rebounds, so they missed 29 shots and got 10 offensive rebounds for our team. That's that's incredibly good. That means we had some grit and toughness around the basket.